Kellogg Australia has had a long and supportive relationship with Aussie farmers for almost a century. And it's working hard with local communities to help ensure the world we live in is in good shape for generations to come. And it starts with this, the very soil to grow crops. Life on the land in recent years has been extremely tough with the weather extremes of flash flooding and drought. For farmers, the key to survival is future-proofing their most precious, most fundamental resource. And that's the aim of the Cool Soil Initiative, unlocking the secrets of the soil to give farmers the information they need for a sustainable future. Kellogg Australia and its industry partners are working hard to quantify greenhouse gas emissions from wheat production to help farmers reduce them by using different farming practices without compromising productivity or profitability. This true paddock to product partnership will work with 200 wheat farmers to help not only nurture the planet, but also produce healthy returns for farmers. The Cool Soil Initiative is designed to work closely with our farmers to help improve soil health, because we know that Better soil health delivers better and more abundant crops. And there's some evidence that it supports better water retention too. While the major benefit of the Cool Soil program is long term, fourth generation farmer Andrew Russell is seeing tangible results already. We've actually got a baseline to actually start to look at um, our soil organic carbon levels, for instance, which we can now actually start to measure and look at trends um, we can st attempt to slow down trends, negative trends, and, uh, and try and turn those trends around so that we can actually grow some soil organic matter in our, um, in our systems. And that's really the holy grail. Wheat farmers Fiona Marshall and her husband Craig are also involved in the program. For them, the benefit is being able to measure long term what is good and bad for the soil. They're no longer flying blind. It's giving them certainty about how to manage their paddocks in an uncertain climatic time. Well, practices that we used before um, are now um, being used with, with more evidence behind them. We're making decisions based on data. You can't fix what you don't measure. With the backing of Charles Sturt University, Cool Soil gives farmers an evidence-based approach to restore their soils. Professor of Food Sustainability at Charles Sturt University, Niall Blair, makes sure the data is right to tackle the ongoing challenge of climate change and its effects on the soil. Well, we know soil health is so important for our farmers, particularly those that are growing grains that are coming out of that soil, and it's, uh, it's the lifeline that they have. Um, but it's not just about making sure that that soil is healthy, it's also about playing their part in reducing greenhouse gas emissions because our farmers are the ones that will bear the brunt if we don't get this climate change challenge right. So through Cool Soil and with the support of our partners, if we are able to increase carbon soil by just 0.1% over the course of three years across about 700,000 hectares of farmland, uh, that would be the equivalent of taking 1.2 million cars off the road. That's pretty significant. Food production is the key to life on the planet. Farmers are on the front line protecting it from the soil up. The next few decades are going to be the most challenging yet. But with the backing of Kellogg Australia and its industry partners, we are in good hands. A farm is one of those things where only custodians of the land and our job is to look after the land as best we can and uh, my self and my wife, our motive is, is to hand on this farm in better condition than what we found it. We need to look after our soil so that our children and our children's children can be farming this country in 100, 150 years. 